I'm black, I'm best dressed, I'm William, and I'm Western Hills. So why do people need an ID? We need an ID because nobody wants to know if you're a stranger, you're part of Hills. This is your territory, like West Side and East Side. You stay here, you need ID to show proof. Proof, you need proof of that. Proof, man. All you have to do is just show it. Where's the ROTC? That's where you get the ID, right? All you have to do. Good morning. Hey, I'm here with Moza and Austin. And if you need an ID, come and get it. This keeps us safe at Western Hills. Wear it. You must have an ID. Good morning, Western Hills. My name is Ben. And I'm Adrian. And these are your announcements for April 15th, 2014. Please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now the Texas Pledge. On the Texas, Texas flag, I pledge allegiance to the Texas, one state, under God, one and indivisible. Please remain standing for a moment of silence. Let's throw it over to Stacey Thomas for sports. Thanks, Adrian and Ben. Congratulations to the following student athletes who have advanced to the area track meet. They will be complete competing in the following events. High jump, third place, Ladarius Bell, 3,200 meter run. Second place, Eden Advili, 800 meter run. First place, Rafael Posada. Second place, Eric Perez, 1,600 meter run. First place, Rafael Posada. Third place, Eden. Again, 200 meter dash. Fourth place, Christopher Hawkins. Junior varsity boys results from the District 74A track meet April 9th and 10th. The junior varsity track meet was District 74A runner up for the team championship, scoring 134 points. High jump, first place, Duane Thomas. Long jump, first place, DeAndre Shelton. Third place, Kyrus Carter. Triple jump, fifth place, A.J. Daniels. Shot put, first place, Kenneth Robinson. 3,200 meter run, first place, Joey Herrera. Sixth place, Julian Stovall. 400 meter relay, second place with the team of Devon Wilkerson, Devontae Wilkerson, Jay Scott, Kenneth Robinson. 800 meter run, first place, Denver Backwell. 100 meter dash, second place, Kenneth Robinson. 110 meter hurdles, fifth place, Austin Adams. 800 meter relay, second place with the team of Devontae Wilkerson. DeAndre Shelton, Devontae Wilkerson, and Jay Scott. 400 meter dash, fifth place, River Moore. 300 meter hurdles, third place, Roderick Morris. And this is from Coach Pritchett. The Lady Cougars competed in the 74A district chat meet Wednesday and Thursday. Varsity athletes advancing to area are Brashe Holloman, first place in the long jump with a jump of 17 feet 5 inches. Sabri Robinson, won third place in the triple jump with a jump of 31 feet 31 inches. Tia Weary, third place, shot put with a throw of 31 feet and 7 inches. Ajia Thomas, fourth place, shot put with a throw of 31 inches, 4.25 inches, I'm sorry, 31 feet. Um, Abria Scott, fourth place, high jump with a jump of 4 feet 8 inches. Other medal winners in the JV division, Yes Correa, second in the 800 and second in the 1600 meter run. Um, when you see these young ladies, please congratulate them on a job well done. It looks like last week was a great one for the Lady Cougars, um, with Coach Bean reporting that the Lady Cougar softball girls beat Arlington Heights 
14 to 0 last Tuesday. Not only did that win clinch at a playoff spot for our girls, it also means their varsity softball program has not lost a height in over six years. We will play at South Hills this Tuesday at home against Granbury this Friday to wrap up district play to determine our playoff city. Um, Friday will also be our senior night, so be sure to come out and support our softball girls as we pummel the Pirates. Go Lady Cougars! Thanks, Stacy. Key Club members, please plan to stay after school Wednesday, April 16th and Thursday, April 17th to help with preparations for the Easter egg hunt Thursday evening. All students, faculty, and staff, Thursday, April 17th, Western Hills Key Club is holding an Easter egg hunt for all who wish to attend. The first hunt is for ages 0 to 12 years and will begin at, 0 p at 7 p.m. on the football field. Ages 13 to 18 years old may participate in the Lights Out event after dark. Special prizes are hidden in eggs for the lucky hunters. Your cost to participate is only one can of food per person benefiting Tarrant County Food Bank. All sophomores and freshmen are required to clock at least five community service hours each year. Your hours, your hours are due by May 16th to the counselor's office. If you need community service hours, please see Ms. Hiller in room 218. 10th grade personal projects are due April 30th. This is a required assignment for all 10th grade students. Please turn in your project, journal, and report to Ms. Lane in the library by the due date. Let's get those overdue library books turned in also. June 7th, put that date down. Graduation will be on June 7th at 3 p.m. in Nickerson Grants. For Cougar TV, I'm Ben. And I'm Adrian. Wishing you a transformative Tuesday.